Now take a look at this video. These older women are really out here in competition with the younger generation. I'm sorry, but it has to be said. These older women who are in their 40s, 50s, even 60s want to be seen so bad and want attention that they are in competition with these younger girls. It's highly inflammatory comments like these that cause division. These women wasted their years, wasted their youth, and are doing any and everything to be seen. And they're not teaching the young girls. I will agree with her here. I don't think enough teaching is happening. And this is the reason why there's such a huge disconnect between the generations. So instead of teaching the young girls to do better, you're trying to compete with her. I actually disagree with her because I don't feel like most women who are in their 40s or 50s are trying to compete with younger women. There is no competition. We have way more wisdom and the younger women are in their prime. You're in denial that you're getting older. Who is denying their age? Most of us, especially us Gen Xers, we are proudly proclaiming our age. Heck, I'm 47. You're doing things with your body, driving for attention, over-sexualizing yourself at that age. And when you talk about people making all these changes to their bodies, most of the people who are doing that are the younger folks. I mean, we got BBLs and lashes and, and skin lightening and a whole bunch of stuff going on. What are we talking about here? All because you don't want to accept the fact that you mess up your life. I think this was meant to be some sort of viral moment because she, she's talking about people messing up their lives. Well, I see a lot of young people messing up their lives now. I don't like this rhetoric. We got to talk about something else. Based on how she's presenting the information, I'm just trying to figure out what is the upside to this? Like, what is she trying to achieve? Because it seems like she's looking to cause a fight or something. They don't have husbands, which they really wanted. They're realizing that, oh, wow, I'm at an age where nobody's checking for me. I, I'm not anti-man. I'm not anti-marriage. I'm, I'm actually married. But to sit there and to insinuate that like these women are these horrible people she didn't use those words but what i am saying is all because they may or may not be married and i, I don't like where this is going i just I, it's just sounding mean the men are not checking for me at 50 60 years old unfortunately they're looking at the younger women who do desire marriage who do desire to have children who are not just out here so instead of again i'm going to try to find a way to be seen and encourage the young girls to do what I'm doing because I don't want them to, to, to surpass me. That's what's actually happening. To be honest, I think it's the younger women who want to be seen as they should. They're in their prime mating years or prime competition years. I don't see too many women of middle age and older trying to compete with young women. These older women are sitting around telling the young girls, no, girl, live your life. Do you? Because you're intimidated by her. You don't want her to do better than you. I'm just trying to figure out what was she trying to prove with this video. This is why there's no sisterhood. We attack all forms of womanhood in our community. It's, it's, it's kind of gross, actually. You don't want her to have a chance. You want the chance. Because you see the, the men are looking at the younger girls. The, the men are more attractive and, and more desirable of the younger women. And it's sad. This, this is the reality of where we are. The older generation is jealous and intimidated and in competition with the younger generation, and it's unfortunate. Okay, so let me just say this. I don't know what her obsession is with the younger generation and their desirability and attractiveness. Um, the way I see it is they're supposed to be desirable and attractive. Those are their prime mating years. But what it sounds like to me is there's this whole value being attached to a woman's proximity to a man. Now, many of you know, I am married with children. I'm an advocate of marriage as long as it's not abusive, as long as it's hopefully rooted in um, their relationship with seeking God and these other things. But to sit there and to attack a whole group of women, I'm just trying to figure out like, what kind of woman is she surrounded by that is that obsessed with the younger crowd that is interested in tearing down a group of women and attacking women? I, I It's just kind of weird. Like, this is all we do in this community is run our mouth and attack each other. It's kind of gross.